It's time to ditch Google's reCAPTCHA system. Basically, it's annoying to solve those letters and the images. Second, it's not free once you hit the limits. And basically, there's a better alternative that's actually free. It's Cloudflare's Turn Style. On this video, I'm going to show you how to install it on a WordPress site. But basically, you can install this on any site. So let me show you how to do this right now. What's up, SaaS Masters? The idea is to ditch, obviously, Google's reCAPTCHA system that needs to basically update how they solve the issue for non-humans and bots, okay? So this is the alternative. I'm going to leave the link for Cloudflare's Turn Style so you can read through this and see all the, the benefits of using this one. But basically, it's ditching CAPTCHA system and using Turn Style, which enables this. With the plugin that we're going to use on WordPress, it's super easy to implement. So it's not no coding, nothing fancy about it. It's just easy to, easy to implement. For example, I have it installed on this site. And if I refresh it, you can see here, better find that I'm a human success. Not a big issue trying to solve images and kind of things that you need to write over there. Okay. And like I mentioned, Google has a limit. So basically it's free from one to 1 million calls per month, which is a whole lot. Don't get me wrong. Right. But if you have a site with a lot of traffic and a lot of of things that they need to solve for captures, well, you might hit that limit and then it's gonna cost you a dollar per 1,000 calls. Now, if you're hitting the one, li 1 million limit, basically you're gonna have uh, thousands of calls more than this, okay? So consider that, that it's not completely free. Now, before we jump into the, how to install the captcha system, I'm gonna show you our sponsor for this video, which is Hostinger. So basically Hostinger has great plans for hosting plans. So if you don't have one now or you plan to make the switch, I do recommend that you jump into Hostinger and check out their BPS plans and their short hosting plans. Now there's an extra discount coupon code that you can check out, which I'll leave here in the link in the description, okay? Now, if you jump over to Hosting, go into Web Hosting, which is their shared hosting systems, you're gonna view all their plans that they have available. So if you select, for example, the most popular one, I'll go ahead and add it to cart. You'll see the extra discount. Now here, the first thing you're gonna be greeted with is choose the amount of time that you want to get this plan for. Obviously, my recommendation is getting it for 48 months. You lock in the price and the renewal price is also cheaper. So you're good to go for 48 months, which is well worth it. Now, right now, the total is $167.52. And if you add my coupon code, which is fast faster, you apply it, it's going to drop the price to 150 bucks with 77 cents. So basically, you're going to get it for cheaper. So don't forget to use the coupon code. Now, jumping over to Turnstile, I'm going to leave the link to the Turnstile documents. Again, if you want to go through these, I do recommend it so you understand the potential of Turnstile and how they managed to make this free, okay? Now, how are we going to install this? So basically, like I said I'm going to show you on a WordPress site. And in this case, I'm going to show you how to do it here. So all I have to do is install a plugin that's going to make everything really easy, okay? So jump into plugins, click on Add New Plugin, and we're going to type in Turnstile. And there's going to be several of these available that does the job. Now, some of these are worse. Some of them might be better, but the one I use is this one, Simple Cloudflare Turnstile, and it's made by Elliot. Okay, so I will install this one and I'm going to activate it. There we go. Let's go ahead and activate this and it should take me to the setup settings. Okay, so here it is. I'm going to get started to get this set up. Now, if it doesn't take you here, jump into settings and you're going to see Cloudflare Turnstile here. Okay, now we're going to need the site key and the secret key that we're going to grab it on Cloudflare. So let's go jump over to our account here. And this is my Cloudflare account. And you're going to see here that I'm, I'm already in the section that says turn style. That's in the main page. You're going to find it here. And we are going to add a new site. So in this case, I'm going to add the site name, which is Cafecio for this one. There we go. I've just selected it and I can add more if I like. But in this case, I want to keep them separate. So I want this managed. Yes, I'm going to create it. And I have my site key. So I'm going to grab my site key. I'm going to add it over here and then I'm going to grab my secret key. And I'm going to paste it over here, which I will delete after this video. So you don't you won't be able to use it. OK, OK, so now we have the theme settings. In this case, it's light detect language. We want it to auto detect. Why would we choose one of these unless you have a specific language and no one or no one else that speaks a different language is going to visit your site. The appearance mode, I want it always or interactive only. In my case, I want it always. Disable the submit button. No, we're going to keep it on. Advanced settings, defer the script, obviously for speed um, improvements. Custom error message, if you want to add that there. Extra failure messages, again, if you want to customize that there. Whitelist settings, so this gives you the, the option to whitelist your own IP, so you don't even get the turnstile icon available there. It's always going to pass. Or in case you're having issues with, a, with an application, that has, I don't know that, maybe the, it's checking the uptime of your site, or maybe it's checking for viruses or something like that. Maybe you want to whitelist that one, okay? And then we have the enable turnstile on your forms. So basically we do want it on the login page. 
I do want it on the register page, WordPress reset one and the WordPress comments, which is really annoying when you have a lot of spam comments. So definitely you need to enable these, okay? And then we are going to save it and we should be good to go. So here we go, it's making the test and boom, it is working. You can test the response. There we go, it's success, everything is correct, okay? So let me go ahead and log out of here. Go ahead and log out. And here we go. Now we have the turnstile available. So that's how easy it is to add turnstile into your WordPress site using this plugin that gives you all the settings and it's going to input the turnstile where you actually need it on WordPress. Now, does turnstile work on different sites? Yes, it does. Okay. It works on any single type of site that you want. PHP sites, WordPress, Joomla, etc. If you have access to the HTML, obviously to add this code. But with WordPress plugin, it's super easy. All you need is the site key and the site secret key and you're good to go. Now, don't forget to use the coupon code that I gave you here in the description so you can jump and grab your hosting plan with a discount. And that's a wrap for Turnstyle.